Mercedes Benz India has launched the 2020 GLC Coupe facelift and prices start at 62 lakh 70 thousand rupees for the 300 petrol variant while the 300D diesel costs 63 lakh 70 thousand rupees. It is the regular iteration of the AMG GLC 43 that was already on sale in the country. However, the model launched in India is the facelifted version of the Coupe SUV. In India, the GLC Coupe is the fourth new product to be launched by the car maker in 2020 and it will compete with the likes of the BMW X4. In terms of powertrain options, the GLC Coupe comes with a pair of 2-litre petrol and diesel engines, while the petrol unit offers 254 brake horsepower and 370 Nm of torque. The diesel unit offers 242 brake horsepower and 500 Nm of torque. Transmission duties are taken care of by the tried and tested 9G Tronic automatic transmission. As standard fitment, an all-wheel drive system too is standard. Volkswagen today revealed its first all-electric SUV and it's called the ID4. The company said that the car will be launched later this year. Following in the tracks of the ID3, the countdown has already begun for the second model based on the new modular electric drive matrix. Based on the ID Cross concept, the ID4 will initially be launched with rear wheel drive, while an electric all wheel drive version will be added to the portfolio at a later date. The company says that thanks to the aerodynamic styling of the ID4, the drag coefficient is reduced and hence the car will be able to offer a range of up to 500 kilometers on a single charge. No other details related to battery or power have been revealed as of now. Yamaha Motor India has completed the transition towards BS6 emission norms ahead of the deadline of March 31st, 2020. The Japanese manufacturer's mass-market two-wheelers vary from 125cc scooters to 250cc motorcycles, which now meet the new emission regulations. This includes the new Fasino and the Ray ZRFI 125cc scooters. Then there are the FZFI, the FZSFI, the YZF R15 version 3, the MT15 and the FZ25 as well as the FZS25 motorcycles. Prices for the range start at 66,430 rupees for the Yamaha Fasino 125 going up to 1,46,000 rupees for the YZF FI. Prices for the BS6 FZ25 will be announced in April 2020, while the FZS25 will go on sale later this year. This also means that Yamaha India will effectively discontinue its entry-level commuter offerings. The company already confirmed the discontinuation of the Fasino and Ray ZR110, while the cord has been cut on the Saluto RX110 Saluto 125 and the SZRR150 motorcycles. We've had 15 years of sheer leadership bringing you the very best of the world of wheels. If you like the best, subscribe to our channel.